What's poppin' guys? Don't forget to like, share, comment, subscribe, hit that notification bell so you'll be notified of all my up and coming videos. And lastly, thank you for watching. Now, let's Turn their ass away. We support R. Kelly. If y'all don't fuck y'all, that's how we feel. We fuck with R. Kelly. You hate motherfuckers. Wanna see another black? I, I laid, I did the song, the song he was supposed to get on from my kid, and this nigga didn't lay his vocals, cause he talking about, I didn't say his name. <sighs> so I said shit, I said, um, I said, um, fuck all the faggots, ask all them questions, stop it. Yeah, Kato's my dog, yeah, I fuck the prophet. Wow. Last thing about R. Kelly, so he got mad, he didn't want to do the song. Oh, you fucking bitch, Damn, you man. fucking bitch, nigga, if I see one, oh yo, but when I, nigga, whenever I see you, I'ma spit in your fucking face, you fucking faggot. Wow. Fucking bitch. He tried to see Jay-Z. Fuck that nigga. He, he, he gonna be showing a few more niggas. <laughs> Trust me. Trust me. He gonna be showing a few more niggas. Let me catch that nigga. My, my, wow. yo, my man kept him safe, dog. And he had enough respect to even talk to a nigga face to face. You gotta talk through the crack in the That's door. Right. Cause you in there with a minor. Oh. <laughs> you, mean, you in there with a minor? You got you got to talk to the crack of the door. You ain't got enough respect to talk to nigga face to face, and I'm here because of you. Wow. Fuck you, fuck you, fuck you, fuck you, nigga. Yeah, his man is like oh, fifteen you. years old. His uncle and his manager. Wow. Said, um, um, I said, yo, ask me what you can be. This nigga is in a room in the studio. Nah. You ain't got enough respect to come to the room I'm in. You mean you in a oh, he's in room? a separate room. He got Except two. He's in a room downstairs. Come on, man. To talk to you. Come, Come on, man. Uncle with his manager. I ain't got a problem with that. Come but on. the way he talked to the nigga was crazy. Like this. He talking to the fucking lock. Yo. <laughs> nah. You're out. You're out. That's what's wrong with the beat. Come on, man. No. I'm sitting right there, like. Oh, that's, that's what's up. That's that wax shit. I, 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 I said, why I can't take a. Let me see you do it. Because, you know, these. It's a fucking beat. That's why. It's a yo. beat. You, you ain't your vocals in on there. It can't nobody put on a mix tape. And hold up. Who the fuck you think I am anyway, nigga? Like, I, wow. I'm not thirsty to leak a fucking song with you. Come on, I don't man. Even fuck with you like that. Yo, now I'm man dead. Damn. My nigga Kato. You know what I'm saying? My nigga Kato, you know what I'm saying? He's like, hey, kept him safe, he's gonna hug. R. Kelly, what's up? We had to send a Def Jam rep. <laughs> yeah, yeah, R. Kelly, what's up, buddy? We got minors in the building. What? You fucking bitch ass nigga, when I see him, I'm gonna spit in your fucking face. Wow. Bang him. Fuck you. R. Kelly. R. Kelly. <laughs> fuck that nigga. Fuck that nigga with an elephant dick, you fucking bitch. <laughs> wow. Rough Rider G Unit Radio. Yes, this is what we do, man. This is how we like it. This is Kato, yo, you know what I'm saying? And me, yo. Yo, nigga, invited me to the studio. Wow. Now, we showed him the video shoot for him. You know what I'm saying? Now, Kato, nigga, Kato was pressing me to do a song for a minute. Wow. Like, oh, I'm gonna do it, I'm gonna do it. Meet him along. Nigga, Kato kept that nigga safe in Chicago. That nigga's pussy. Wow. Now, so, I showed up in the studio on his behalf to do a song for him. So, I tell nigga, now, he, was, he wasn't even at the studio, but I'm still there. Because I'm a professional. Shit. So, I said, all right, I'm gonna bang. Lee, what up? All right, I'm gonna bang my shit out, you know what I'm saying? So, I say, yo, you know what? Let me take the show, let me take the beat, you know what I'm saying, back to the hotel. And, and Last week the nigga on. was the king of R&B and we was praising him. and no, every, I wasn't. They had this conversation. Everybody who's denouncing this nigga now called him the king of R&B last week. You never seen me with this dude. Right. What are you talking about? Like, because he with him, I'm with him. You don't see no picture of me with him. Even down to that Fiesta stupid shit everybody talking about. Right. I wasn't in no scene with homie. Right. I was like, yo, I'm not getting no scene with homie. Period. You don't see it. You're looking for it. You never find it. Don't ever put that shit on me. That, hey, I, I, I find it offensive. I understand. You, you fucking in with my character like that. I've never fucked with dude. And because my girl said leave it alone, I left it alone. Right. So I can't bring no awareness to it. I can't do nothing. Right. I just got to wear it. Right. So if I don't agree with somebody I'm working with is doing, I can't publicly out my man. Right. But really, how's he my man if he's still doing if that? If he's still doing it. But that. then if I do that, I fuck up Beans money, Cam money, Kanye money, everybody money. So now what I'm going to do? So I'm going to just say, look, I'm going to take a silent protest. And now the entire world feels the same way that you feel. And is it one of those things where you looking like I've been trying to tell you?
Future, uh, if R. Kelly wants a track, are you recording with R. Kelly? Man, who's who is that? I thought we had forgot about that. There he is. The world, the, the gram has not. We're giving it too it. much attention. You know what I'm saying? Is that what it is? When you give things too much attention, they blow up. That's why he gonna blow up. That's why his music gonna do what it is. Cause y'all well, keep talking about it. Stop selling. talking about it. It'll go away. True. That's do you very think true. there's a sense of fake outrage? I don't know what it That's is. What? It's just too many people talking about it. You know uh-huh. what I'm saying? I, pe- I think, Reverse well, psychology, right? I think behind the scenes, it's supposed to be things done how they're supposed to be done, mm-hmm. and start giving it negative attention. They ain't got no cookies in there? They ain't got none. Shit. Not none, dog. A store like that? They ain't got none. I want a cookie. They ain't got none. I want a cookie. They ain't got none. I want a cookie, they ain't yeah. Got none. I want a cookie. They ain't got none. <laughs> Y'all stupid. Man, I'm just walking <laughs> by, bro. That's why I just mind my business, man. Cause they- my life is the way my nose. Oh, 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 says about that but let me tell you something 14 15 year olds they know what they're doing nowadays yeah but they're being taken advantage of i, I hear people say that all the time that's not the answer they're still 14 they and know what they're doing nowadays listen the brain didn't change your brain is forming until you're like 18 years old you i hate that response because i can't 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Just because at 18 you're an adult. Baby, I don't want to hurt nobody. But there is something that I must confess. Somebody make some mother Hey, y'all motherfuckers don't know. It's my mother birthday and I don't give a Y'all are so crazy. Mm. Uh, I've read a lot of comments about me, and little do they know I was behind the whole operation, not knowing that I've made millions of dollars off of your opinion. Let me tell you how I made this money. First off, uh, I actually got a call from one of my good business buddies, Arnold Collabar. He liked that dark coffee. Uh-huh. Uh, he called me and told me it was my time. He said, I'm about to get you millions of dollars. And I was all is because there's money involved. <laughs> um, he said, we're going to put this out on Lifetime. A series of allegations against me, which the world already know. Uh, so immediately I got on the phone with all the women that I used to talk to back then that was good friends of mine. And I told them, uh, I said, this is our chance to make millions of dollars. I even paid my ex-wife off to be a part of this. So stop. I Strawberry, what's you. up? The price of pussy, what's up? It keep going up. Good morning, this is Ling Ling again, and today I just want to give you some motivational bits, okay? So, if you wake up today and you want to do something, you get up and you do what you got to do. You about to blast off, okay? Whatever you like, you do, you get it, you go, you get the money, you get the honey, you get the booty, whatever you like. And if you don't want to do anything, and if you're just lazy, you sit and you complain, 
And then uh, I think you just have to eat ass, die fast.